Hosea is an 8th century prophet to the nation of Israel, the northern kingdom. He comes on the scene right when that kingdom begins to decline. That's why it's at the beginning of the Minor Prophets. And they descend into utter corruption and basically violate the covenant bonds with their God through idolatry, what Hosea describes as adultery in his image. And so in order to demonstrate the unending and unconditional love of God towards his people, God sends Hosea to fulfill what is a living parable or a living drama. He has him, Hosea, marry a prostitute named Gomer to love her unconditionally, to bring him, her into his life. And she bears him children, which he names, and she leaves him. And through her prostitution ends up back into slavery. And so in utter humiliation, Hosea has to go and buy his wife out of slavery. What's the point? The point is this, and Hosea's message is very simple. God's love for us is so radical and goes to such ridiculous lengths that it makes him look foolish in saving such unworthy people. Paul said the very same thing in 1 Corinthians chapter 1. It is the foolishness of God. And in Hosea, after all their sin had been committed, God says to his people, how can I give you up? And how can I surrender you? How can I treat you like Zebulun? My heart is turned over within me and all my compassions are kindled. We are saved by the unconditional, unmerited, impartial, and eternal love of God.